828 with the Free Country Wake Up Crew. Tom Whalen with Dina Carroll. Nine above zero. And we have Dee Dee from our... <laughs> From Frederick County Animal Control Adoption with our Shockley Honda Pet of the Week every Tuesday. Good morning, Dee. Good morning. Go to the WFRE Facebook page. Check out this handsome guy. This is Oswald. It is. We think. We uh, made up the name, Oswald. Well, you made up the name. Right, right. Um, He is a beautiful male black cat between one and two years old. Super friendly. Loves to have his head scratched. And he has no tail. And he looks like the kind of cat that was born without. Some people call him Manx. Obviously, uh, we're not calling him a purebred Manx, but... Um, he was born with no tail, and uh, he's got a big, chunky head, which a lot of people really like in uh, young male cats. And he's really sweet. He was a really stray. Sweet. That means yeah. he was picked up somewhere. Right. And he is so friendly that we know he, that he was at least raised by people. But sometimes these young guys were um, a mama cat that's loosely owned and fed and sheltered, had kittens. Well, when those kittens get to be teenagers, they got to go on their own. And uh, someone will find them because they're friendly and look for their owner. And if they don't find them, bring them to the shelter. And he wasn't chipped and he didn't have a collar Correct. or anything like that. How is the kitty population at uh, the shelter? Well, as far as the shelter's concerned, it's okay, good I understand because, because we you, have space. You have space, but a lot, of, a lot of the kittens are in foster homes. Yeah, but it, we have over 20 cats that need homes. So. Oh, man, adult cats, too. Right. Sweet kitties. What about Gozer, who was here last week? Because he has been on my mind ever since he came in here. He got adopted. Yay! <laughs> I knew he would get adopted. You guys do a great job did they, here. Did they say we heard about Gozer or um, saw him on the WFRE Facebook I didn't Facebook do his page? interview, so I don't know. But I know that helps because we have a little checkbox on the form where people check off how they found out about the dog. And I think it's... Um, uh, the last time I checked, it was around 15% are from the radio. Oh, that's nice. So it is nice. He was uh, he was quite a commitment because he was a big guy. Yeah, oh, yeah. He was 80 to 100 pounds. And um, we had uh, an older Rottweiler that was adopted by someone who works at Frederick um, Farmers Co-op. We had um, an old um, Cocker Spaniel with uh, ear problems, okay. ongoing problems. Yes, I he understand. He got adopted yesterday. They have ear problems because of the length of their ears. Right, and their long hair. Uh-huh. And, um, so it, um, just, you know, everyone's great in Frederick. They love animals, and they're always willing to come and look at our place first. And you have the Kitty Cabana. At the shelter where you can see cats interacting Cous-cous with other still kitties. There. Couscous is still yes. there. Look, kittens are adorable. Yes. They're not kittens that long. They grow into full-grown adult cats. Very fast. These cats need homes. Some of them can live up to 19 years. They can be very sweet, very uh, very good with kids. Go, You can go to the shelter and ask for ask for Oswald right? and hold him on your lap. I guarantee you'll fall for oh, this guy in a minute. <laughs> He is a sweetie. I want to get him back out of his carry before he's out of here. Thank you, Dee Dee. Thanks for having WFRE us. WFRE Facebook page, our Shockley Honda Pet of the Week, Oswald, a black beauty. And he's got that Manx bobtail.